It has never been easier to create beautiful personalized invitation for your events using my pre-designed but editable templates. You can edit and then share, post, text, send, or print. Join me for a quick tutorial on how from printtoparty.com. In this video, I'm just using a baby shower as an example, but just know no matter what invitation you purchase, whether it's holiday, bridal, baby, etc., they all behave the same. You will get a link upon purchase. When you click the link, it will take you to a page that looks exactly like this. It will take you into Canva. Canva is free to use. You just click that purple button and you will um, get the template. As you see, all of the text boxes are highlighted and that means you can manipulate these text boxes in any way, shape or form. You can change the font color, the font size, you can change the font itself, you can change what it says, pretty much create and personalize it for your own. So let's say you just want to do a bridal shower. You can change it to a bridal shower. I think I'm gonna keep it as a baby shower though. And then you can click and change the color of the font. So you click up here to text color, the colors will load and you literally can use any, every color in the rainbow, but I really like this photo colors. It pulls in the template and um, you can choose some of the colors that are in the template already. And I really like the green, so I'm gonna leave that. You can change the font itself. You click up here to font. On the right, thousands of fonts will load, thousands. Yes, some of them you will notice have these little crowns that's for Canva Pro only, but do not worry if you do not have a Canva Pro account, there are still thousands of fonts for you to choose from. So um, you can choose whatever font you want. Okay, so I think I'll just do this one for the video. Then you can manipulate the size of the font and there are two ways you can do that. First way, just up here, increasing the font size if you want. Another way you can increase the font size is if you just drag the box and um, it makes it bigger. So I'll just drag this one, make it bigger. And then this one, I'll just do that there. So then you can increase your font size. Again, you can manipulate the text to say whatever you would like. Again, RSVP here, this block you can keep, you can delete. Um, if you don't want to put a phone number, say you want to put an email, you can do that. Say you want the email to stand out, just highlight that portion of your text, change it to a different color so it stands out. Registry, pretty typical on some um, baby shower websites where you can say where everybody's registered at. And then you can even add another box if you wanted to and say something like, please bring a pack of diapers. I know a lot of times they will do that at, at showers. I'm gonna change that to the green. So once you are done manipulating your shower and has everything on there that you would like to say and you're ready to either print it or share it, this is how. If you are printing it for, for mailing, you go to download and you choose uh, PDF print. It will download this on regular paper. It's a size five by seven, easy to cut out, fits in A7 envelopes. If you would like to save this as a image that say you would like to post on social media, maybe post on an event website or even email or text, you download it as a, I like PNG file, and I always increase it a little bit to make it crisper and cleaner, download it, and I will show you how easy it is to um, send. Okay, so I downloaded everything from Canva. It shows up in my downloads folder. The PDF would be the printable version, should you wanna go that route. It literally opens up in a PDF. It is sized five by seven. You just print this out on regular paper and it's super easy to cut out. And if you do go this route, I recommend a seven envelopes. If you decide you want to share your image invitation on social media, an invitation website via text or email, it's also super, super easy. I'm just gonna use email for this video. Let's see, I'm gonna just do, I think her name is Emily, baby shower. And then you just insert it as an image into your email. Shows up beautifully. You can do text, social media, posting, however you'd like to share it. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please like and subscribe. I'm always posting tutorials on all of my products. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.